Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we are covering the Old Earth Pistol. It is basically a, a modern day 9mm pistol. Nothing fancy or impressive about it. You see them all over the place. Um, yeah. I've done an Old Earth hunting rifle and I had a terrible time with it and didn't think very much of it at all. I'm a little bit dubious about this one simply because it's old earth. I'm concerned it's going to be quite weak. I'm trying to keep an open mind and not be quite so negative. So we'll see how we go. Let's cover the basics. Obviously 45 caliber rounds, 9 round magazine, 47 physical damage, 68% accuracy, 4 mod slots which is quite low but for an old style weapon when this game is based then you wouldn't expect much 22 range so very very close range for modifications we're looking at things like your armor piercing rounds you can put a comp compensator on there hair trigger high power high velocity you'll have to choose between some of these a larger magazine a suppressor or a shortened suppressor and you can put a tactical grip on there which will probably help with a little bit of accuracy it might mitigate some of the recoil when you fire as well no guarantees on that but you never know uh, apparently not that I've seen it but if you want to buy this or a variant of it then you're looking at Neon Tactical or the Roland Arms I honestly can't confirm that I have been to both and I don't remember seeing even an advanced version you will get lots of these drop by way of loot though so uh, I was lucky enough to find a standard one but most of them you'll get the advanced versions which are m significantly more powerful so uh, yeah let's give this one a whirl if this turns out to be really really weak then this video may turn into a double and I'll do another pistol that I've got as well and we'll combine the two but hopefully this works out so First things first, and check, aim down the sights, iron sights, terrible. But that's to be expected. I I didn't think very I didn't think there was gonna be much to the, the sights to be honest, so not a huge problem there. Uh, before we before I dive in and get shot at a lot, just to point out I'm being critical, but it's just my own personal opinions of the weapon. Anybody that's watched my videos will know that these are just my personal opinions. If I gripe about a weapon, it's because of my own um, drawbacks with it. It's not to say that it's a bad weapon in somebody else's hands. It could well be a brilliant weapon. I'm quite happy to say that I'm not the best, per the best judge when it comes to certain weapons and pistols and shotguns are not my thing. So just keep that in mind when you're watching my videos. And I know it says a review, but it's not strictly a review, I just couldn't think of a better title, it's just a showcase of what the weapon does to see if it's something that you might be interested in. And he's Superman. So yeah, there we go, that's my little rambling sentences pushed out. Let's showcase and see what we can do. That was a pretty impressive start. Let's see what else we can pull off with this thing. The low level. I, I tried to find somewhere a bit higher level, but it's hot luck what missions I've been picking up recently. Well, first impressions I have to say are headshots are good. Uh, it's quite surprising. Yeah, it's surprising in a good way. I'm always happy to be proven wrong when it comes to certain weapons. All weapons, to be perfectly honest. Sorry, a bit of looting. And there'll be some more mobs around here somewhere. This is quite a small base, so it shouldn't take too long to clear it. I think it's a bit higher level. There we go. It's not bad. 
for a, for an old style weapon without much in the way of good firepower, but it could have been a lot, lot worse. I'm quite impressed with that. Let's continue on and see what we can do. Oh, he's much higher level. There we go. That's quite accurate. I was expecting it to be a lot worse. I was expecting it to be a really terrible weapon. But that's doing a pretty decent job for a standard 9mm pistol. Just heal up. I don't want to die on this, that'd be embarrassing. Again, you're not gonna take him out one shot with a pistol. Not that this, this damage from capabilities is not, but it's a good recoil. These sights aren't flying up as you're trying to hit things. There's no uh, arm piercing rounds in here, so it is just standard stuff. Could have been a whole lot worse. I'm happy to say I'm quite impressed. It's nice and accurate. It uh, reloads quickly. It's simple to use. You put a sight. I'm assuming you can get a sight. Did I read a sight out? No, you can't. No sight capability on that, but still. If you were to fit, say, the suppressor and maybe your armor piercing rounds or the high powered rounds into it with a hair trigger to get a bit more speed out of it, this could be quite a formidable close range weapon. Again, sneaking would be a, a good option for this. him uh, yeah so that is the old earth pistol um, surprisingly effective it, I was expecting it to be really really bad when I'm um, considering the uh, the uh, old earth hunting rifle was just such a disaster but that one worked out I can get through the door. <laughs> so yeah, it's, uh, that's a nice weapon. I, I don't like aiming down the sights of it. I just find that it gets in the way. I'm missing one like that. And I got him through the door. <laughs> oh, I do love it when things like that happen. Um, yeah, simple, straightforward, nothing to really write home about. Effective weapon. Quick reload. There's someone else around. Where are they? Yeah, a nice quick reload. Stable firing, which is always a plus with a pistol. Uh, you can increase the damage capabilities and the handling capabilities, which is highly recommended. All in all, a nice all-round pistol. If you're going to look for a pistol, I would still recommend the Eon or the Urban Eagle, or the Purple or Legendary variants of those. But if you're going for a more rustic, authentic build with one of your characters, then this is something you might want to consider if you're doing some sort of uh, law enforcement 
role play for one of your playthroughs then having this as a sidearm would suit the build re quite well uh, or just a bit of fun it's a nice pistol uh, doesn't quite compare to the uh, the Eon or the Urban Eagle in my opinion but still very comparable when you consider some of the other disasters that are pistols it's got a good fire range to it, it's got a good firepower to it it's just a, it lacks in modifications which is which is a bit of a shame but considering it is an old earth weapon it's not modern, it's not designed to have modifications put on it so that's to be expected but still a nice little weapon and a good little find if you can pick one up especially if you can pick one up for free So I hope you enjoyed that. I think I'm about to have company. Maybe not. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, uh, a thumbs up would be appreciated. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought of it. Um, if you've used this weapon and got a nice version of it, if you found the advanced one and given it all its little toys and it performs significantly better, which I expect, let me know. If you found a legendary with some very nice traits, feel free to leave a comment. I'd love to hear about that. There was a comment on my Magshear video where somebody farmed up a very nice legendary. Congratulations to them. It's always nice to see when you get some random drop that gives you a really good variant of your, the weapon you've been after. Other than that, I'll get shot at through a big steel door. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.